<laughs> and now we send it to the greatest ring announcer of all time, the one and only. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, let me welcome you to the fabulous Mercedes-Benz Stadium here in ATL, Atlanta, Georgia, USA, where tonight Triller Fight Club is proud to present the main event of the evening, eight rounds of boxing in the cruiserweight division. And this is sanctioned by the Georgia State Athletic Commission and sponsored by DraftKings. Commission Executive Director Matt Woodruff at ringside, the three judges scoring. Ed Canner, Nola Oliver, and Richard Sells. And inside the ring, in charge of the action at the bell, your referee, Brian Stutz. And now, the officials are in place and they are ready. The fighters are in the ring and they are ready. So from Mercedes-Benz Stadium, Atlanta, Georgia, to the millions watching around the world, uh, let's get ready to rumble! <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing black and white and weighing in officially at 191 pounds. He's a two-time Big Ten champion in wrestling, two-time NCAA champion in wrestling, a 2008 wrestling U.S. Olympian, and as a world-famous mixed martial artist, has a record of 19 victories with only two defeats. From Heartland, Wisconsin, USA, Funky Ben Askew. And across the ring, his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, wearing yellow and black, and officially weighing in at 191 and one half pounds. His professional record, Two fights, two victories, two wins by knockout from the Buckeye State of Ohio, but now living, training, and fighting out of Miami, Florida, USA, the undefeated digital superstar, Jake the Problem Child Paul. Had your instructions, obey my commands at all times, protect yourselves at all times. These are good, these are a little high, but they're all right. Let's have a clean one. Touch it up. Let's go. Jake Paul looking to remain undefeated. Funky Ben Askren making his pro boxing debut. Ray oh, Forrest, Snoop Dogg, Mario Lopez, Al Bernstein, wow. Pete Davidson, Crime yes. Faces. Wow. Gentlemen, buckle your seatbelts. Here we go. Oh, about to Let's come. go. Oh, it's about to go down. Waste no time and get to it and do it. Here we go. Ben ain't got time to fill out nothing. You ain't filling out Woo! no applications. Ain't nobody hired, so we ain't filling out no applications. Ben this got is that, not a uh, fill out. Ben got that Vince Vaughn body. <laughs> oh, he has a body. Oh, he has nice a nice overhead right. Nice overhead right. Ben Askren's built like a bag of milk, but yeah. he's got that country strength. Well, yeah, Fred, Freddie Roach Red. did say that Ben Askren does have deceptive power. The Hall of Fame trainer himself, he did say that Ben Askren, if he fights the right fight, can defeat Jake Paul. Freddie Roach was complimentary of his work ethic and the fact that he did everything he asked. And you know what? Already, Ben, ben Askren's on the go, inside. Hey. He's trying to wrestle already. Yeah, he's, he's trying, trying to get inside. Uh, that's, what he, that's what he needs to do to be victorious. He needs to fight him like a wrestler. Get inside, muscle him out, tire him down. And control the fight. And control the fight. I hope they start kissing. <laughs> yeah. You think they'll start kissing? That's what I'm oh, here for. Oh, oh, okay. What Jake Paul did predict before two rounds are done, he's going to put away Ben Askren. He ain't being oh. out there fighting like a 1940s fighter with that old ass style. Yeah. <laughs> he's going to change that style. Look, that's that, uh, oh, okay. that, that Come uh, old on, ass. Hey! Jake hey, Paul on, being a lot back, more disciplined back. than I thought. Yeah, that's yeah, the style Jake. the fighters used to use in the 1930s. He's going to change that shit up. Oh, Jake, there's a oh, left hook go. on the top of the head by Paul. Oh, hey, shit. Shot dude. to the body, body. shot to them. Ribs. Bang! Right to the motherfucking head. He's a fucking bad boy, dude. He is. Jake, get down. I try Jake's to tell you. Jake's a bad boy. You think I'm going to put $2 million on the motherfucking goofball? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, Jake Paul sparred with former world champion Jean Pascal. And get also my money, Jake. Get my motherfucking money, Jake. Get my
What a right hand!